It's March 14, 2023. I'm at the Savannah WFNFN Community Garden. So this is a PSA. You cannot just shove whole entire fruits into the raised beds, at the surface of the raised beds. Why? Because that will get in the way of putting plants in, especially if you don't tell anybody. And these all have seeds in them. Fruit, valuable fruit tree seeds, which will eventually sprout. And if we don't know what they are, they would get pulled up by mistake, thinking they're just weeds. So, if you have whole entire fruits, and you are too lazy to take the seeds out so that we can plant them, you have to, at the very least, take off the sticker, because you cannot compost, compost plastic, and that will just mess up the bed. So, you have to take the whole fruit, no sticker, dig to the very bottom of the bed, and put that in. Here's how deep this hole is. It goes down to the bottom. But you cannot just have whole entire fruits that still have seeds in them at the surface of the bed. That includes these apples. We could be growing apples from the seeds in these, but we can't do that properly if you just put them at the surface and don't tell anybody because then the apple seedlings will eventually come up and we'll just think they're trash and pull them up. Same for strawberries. Do not put strawberries in the bed. If we can be very easily growing more strawberry plants from your rotted strawberries. So for now, I've placed one of the big buckets up here with like half the fruit that was put in here and some soil. So literally just pile the fruit in here. Leave these ones here because we will come back tomorrow and I will take all the seeds out so we can get our own apple, orange, lemon, and strawberry plants for free because you can grow the seeds in these. So keep those there. If you have new stuff, take the sticker off and then put it in here. If it's an apple or an apple core, take the seeds out. You can compost orange peels, lemon peels, stuff like that, but we don't want valuable seeds that we can be growing going to waste, which is what happens if you're just going to chuck whole fruit in here. Especially because some of us, there's nothing wrong with it. Like, one of these oranges in here was pretty much perfect. I don't know which one it is now. But yeah, don't put whole fruits into the raised garden beds. We have, we have a specific plan for this bed here and this one here. If you want, if you have your own bed, you can put whatever you want in there, but not in these front beds. We have a plan for what kinds of foods we're going to grow in them. And if we have apple seeds coming up, we won't realize it's what they are and they will just go to waste. All right, so bye-bye. So stick your compost in here. We're back in the actual compost bins. That's it, bye-bye.